If you're like me and you're constantly paranoid about receiving corrupted files, downloading corrupted files, or just transferring videos, photos, and other media, well, this video is for you because I'm gonna be showing you the number one tool on how you can recover corrupted files. Let me show you Repair It from Wondershare. So here we are within Repair It. This is a very powerful tool because it can repair video files, photo files, email files, PDFs, and so forth. So if you're a filmmaker, a travel vlogger, just a media person in general, this is a great program. Now, before we go over some of the features of Repair It, I do wanna cover important things that you must do to minimize the risk of corruption. First things first, back up and use redundancy. For example, dual SD card slots in your camera record to both of them simultaneously. Back up once a week minimum. If you're a content creator and you do this full time, back up your hard drives to multiple different hard drives. Two, use reliable hardware. Try not to buy off-branded hardware because we don't really know the reliability. Buy from known brands such as SanDisk, Crucial, and so forth. Simple research on YouTube or the internet in general will let you know which brand is reliable. Also, use antivirus software and minimize malware on your computer. This will decrease the chance of you experiencing corruption by a lot. And my last tip is to constantly update the programs on your computer. Make sure you're using the latest version of your operating system. This again, makes sure that your computer is more compatible with all of the files that you're working with. All right. Now let's talk about repair it. So we're gonna have a look at video repair right now. Here's my SD card right here on the right side. This was recorded with a Sony A7S Mark III and it detects video files just fine. This SD card has been working lately, but I've had instances in the past where some SD cards just weren't recording video files properly. If your video files ended up being corrupted, you would not be able to see any thumbnail. So if you do have that problem, all you have to do is just drag and drop it into the program itself. And after you drag and dropped it, it will load up right here. We do see a thumbnail here. This is a healthy video file, but again, this is just for demonstration purposes. So all we would have to do is just click on the advanced repair mode because this will scan the video file and you will have a better chance of repairing it. So we're gonna click on repair. When you click on repair it, this window will pop up it's gonna ask you for a sample video so it can copy similar settings from a healthy video file to your corrupted video file. This increases the chance of you repairing this file tremendously. So the format it recommends you to find is MP4 and you can see all the other options right below that. So I'm just gonna select this sample file, I'm gonna drag and drop it here, and now it's gonna to check to make sure all those settings match, and they do, and now we're gonna click on repair. Now advanced repair does take longer than standard repair, and I do recommend always going for that advanced option. Okay, so it looks like it's been successful, and then we are going to click on the preview and see what it came up with. So obviously this video file came out just fine, and now we're just gonna hit the save button, and you can export it to any folder on your computer or external drive. In the latest version of Repair It, you can now fix GoPro gyroscopic data. Repair It is the only software right now that supports this feature. So if you have a faulty GoPro file, you can restore it using a healthy GoPro file and you can finally get back to editing your travel videos. Now let's have a look at some of the other features with Repair It. So here we see other types of repair, photo repair, file repair. These are very powerful tools, but we also get enhancer tools too. So if I select AI Photo Enhancer, it will take a blurry photo and well, I'll let it do the trick for you so you guys can see. So here we have the photo, clearly it's very blurry. It looks like a portrait, so I'm gonna click on portrait. We're gonna increase the resolution while we're at it to 800% and I'm gonna go and click on start enhancing. Let's see what it does. All right, it's all done, let's click okay. And now we can see the before and the after. This is phenomenal, look at that. It did a great job. So yes, I'm definitely satisfied with the result. And you can do this with multiple different photos. It accepts a ton of different formats. So I'm happy with the result. You can save it to anywhere on your computer or external drive. Now if we go back to home, you can see the file repair, and now we have audio repair as well. And 
all of these work exactly the same as the video repair. You're going to add a file and then you're going to select the sample audio file that it can export the same settings with. And with this new version of repair it, there is a much higher success rate. So if you want to give it a shot and see if this program even works for you, you can download it for free, give it a try and see how it does. Make sure you check out the link down below and I'll see you in another video. Peace.